the success and failure of any production, especially in theater, starts with the choice of scripts, you know, the story you want to tell. And so I kind of found the stories that um, Joseph Edgar pens, I find them very interesting, very engaging, and that's why I decided to, you know, to find a way to interpret it for the stage, because I read them, he didn't write them to perform. He wrote them just as his runs, you know, like you're blogging for somebody to just read and enjoy. And I found his stories very, very engaging because of the profound yet simple stories he tells. So the stories are profound, but he tells them in a very simple way. Edgar, famously known as Edgar J, he's literally the only person that can come into my office and get me to start rolling and talking and talking by all his achievements, which in my view are quite remarkable. VFD Group is an investment company, a company that believes in the potential of um, the ordinary people. We also have an ordinary story, albeit with remarkable ambition. The Duke has gone mad again as he has uh, captured this project of his. I'm particularly excited about what he's doing and we at VFD Group, we think that it's a project that needs to be supported because of the job creation potentials that it holds and the ability for it to tell our story in a remarkable way. We've achieved a lot in Africa, but one thing we've failed to do is to tell remarkable stories. These stories can best be told in art forms, in plays, in movies, in poetry, and in all forms of art that goes beyond man's existence. In the last three years, we've dropped some very powerful productions on the Nigerian theatre space, but that's not the story I'm going to tell you guys today. I want to cover my new project, The People's Theatre. It's going to be the biggest and the largest privately owned theatre production company in Africa. We're going to push for 500 shareholders, it's going to cost us 9 billion dollars to drop this theatre. It's going to be quite expensive to get recital halls, performing theatres, blocks of uh, residential apartments, the food court and all of that. Basically what we're trying to do is to institutionalize fundraising in the theatre space you get, to ensure a continuous flow of sustainable funding towards entertainment you know, so that we'll be able to create jobs, you get, create wealth, redistribute wealth and also show what we can do as a people with strong resolve. We see a lot in common with what Edgar is doing. We believe that People should be supported. We believe that the story should be told in a way that inspires the next generation. And we believe that people like Edgar should be supported in ways that they, they start to create the foundation uh, for the new African Renaissance and the new image of Africa that has to more or less project and build a successful base. Chiki, Ray Bonans, Orange Line, and Duke of Show Productions are coming together to, to own this project. It's called the People's Theatre. It's going to be cited somewhere in Lagos and it's going to once again redefine the land space. I wish you a remarkable project. I know you will always do well. Um, and I know that your story, regardless of the message it passes, will get people to smile and get people to relax and get people to have a fantastic night. I want to be part of this dream. Let's make this happen. Thank you.